Well, we're out on the water. It's 5.20 a.m. That makes it so worth it. I haven't even caught a fish yet. I haven't even started fishing. I just put the boat in the water. But look at that. I gotta make a quick run across this lake over to the next lake, so I guess we should do that now, huh? your musky fish and I actually bass fished this one spot because I thought it looked really good and I happen to have a bass rod with so this is actually one of the spots that I'm actually going to start off pre-fishing and I'm just going to be lightly hitting it with a frog I'm just doing this to gauge if there's going to be fishing here because if I know there's going to be fishing here then obviously I'm going to want to hit it I'm not sure how dark this footage is going to be it's still quite early but What's different from last year's is actually a fallen tree up here. So we'll see. How the last time I had to spend on this, the better though. Cause I don't want to go all the way through here, figure out that there's no fish. Oh, there was my first blow up right there. Oh, I just missed him, little guy. Now in this tournament, the fish have got to be 12 inches. It's the best 12 that you get. And there's also a big fish. And then if you really suck like me, you, there's the small fish bag. Okay. All right. Either this lake is not a super early bite. Or I am screwed. some slack cut me some slack geese all right if I don't get a fish in this channel then I'm not even gonna bother fishing channel at all there we go oh shoot that was my first fish right up against that wall I was not expecting that this is proving to be tough so at this point, I want to move over to this next channel, which looks like it goes back further. I don't know, tomorrow's going to be a long day. Guess what it is, it's northern. I'm pre-fishing for bass and this is what I get. I mean, I'm not gonna really complain because I caught a fish. I'm trying to catch bass, not these. Okay, that's a bass. He's not big enough to even keep in the tournament because he's not no 12 inches, but I guess that's a fish.
I don't know what that is, but that is. Oh, it's a dog. It's a dog. I just caught a dog on top water. Crazy. <laughs> okay, that makes it worth it right there. Oh, he came off too. These fish are awesome. They are on a lot of people's bucket lists. And most of the time you catch them sight fishing. This is actually the first one I've ever caught on top water. What's neat about these fish is not only are they ancient, but you can keep them out of the water for a long time and the fish will be fine. Uh, they're just like a snakehead. So they have the ability to, uh, to breathe air and you can see the, the awesome green coloring on this fish. And if you look on the, on the tail, you can see that spot. And that's to simulate an eye. So if a fish were to attack this, it would go for the tail. But this is just a little guy. They get a lot bigger than this. Definitely not the biggest one I've caught, but that's pretty cool. I flipped right up onto the, uh, the shore and I saw the water move a little bit. And uh, I twitched it and I got bit. So not what I'm after. I'm after bass, but that's pretty cool. I'll take that any day. So unfortunately, I'm going to have to call it quits. Not because I want to, but because I pretty much have to. I have no other options right now it's just it's been a rough day um i did a little bit of musky fishing i barely scratched the surface at all and uh as long as my trolling motor battery lasted i was bass fishing and i, I mean I, I i did find some fish and i and i caught that one and i guess i have a decent idea of what i have to do um but yeah i mean there's just no point for me to be out here because uh the only thing i was going to do and that I have been doing was trolling for muskies, but unfortunately my trolling reel just hit the sh Like it just, there's nothing, it's not supposed to do that. This is like the third or fourth piece of equipment to break for me in the last week. Sounds a lot like last year. So that sucks, and I think that's just kind of my cue to get out of here. I've been out here since six, so I put three and a half hours on. Uh, unfortunately, again, this probably wasn't that great of a video because I didn't catch a lot of fish, but it is a pre-fishing video, so there is a point to put it out there. And yes, until the next video, which should be tomorrow, I will catch you guys when my equipment has been not broken. See ya.